Advanced Care Planning. Advanced Care Planning, also known as ACP, is a way of expressing your wishes and values and medical treatment in the event you are no longer able to speak for yourself. These plans do not come into effect until the person is unable to speak for themselves. By taking this step to consider and discuss your wishes, advanced care planning is one of the best ways you can ensure the care you want for yourself. In order to have your beliefs respected, you should make them known by those you love and your health care provider. In a 2012 survey, over 80% of Canadians have never considered ACP, and only 9% have ever discussed their wishes for their care. Yet, there are so many benefits of ACP, including peace of mind for those you love, improving communication, reducing uncertainty in decision-making, and reducing strain on the healthcare system. For people who have spiritual beliefs that differ from those around them, or feel that there could be disagreements from other loved ones about care, an advanced directive, a representative agreement slash appointing a substitute decision maker is especially important. An advanced directive, also known as an AD, is a written component of ACP that refuses a type of healthcare treatment, a do not resuscitate, a refusal of blood transfusions, etc. This serves to reduce serious conflict and prevent the risk of receiving treatments that are not aligned with your values or serve to prolong suffering. ACP can be completely free and can be done by any adult at any time, so long as they have the capacity to do so. As we all know, life can change in the blink of an eye, and in a world where many do not share our beliefs, it's important to share what matters to you so that it can be respected. Don't wait to plan for this. Having the conversation. There are many ways to begin advanced care planning, but a comprehensive approach should include having conversations, a written record, or video documenting values and wishes, the appointment of a substitute decision maker, and their contact information. Advanced care planning does not need to be a formal procedure. Any steps you take to having conversations about your wishes with the people you love and your providers is a good step. Go Wish is an advanced care planning and end-of-life planning card game. These include cards such as to have my funeral arrangements made, to be free from pain, to meet with clergy or chaplain, which you place into one of three categories of importance as determined by you. Discussing these cards may help you consider aspects of end-of-life care you have previously not considered and make arrangements to include or exclude them from your care and environment. The game is optimistic and seeks to facilitate open conversation and set goals for defining the best end of life possible. Find a link to the free version in the resources section here. Reflection. Does this seem like an easy or a challenging conversation to have for you? How can you make it more comfortable? Documenting your wishes. BC has an advanced care planning guide entitled My Voice, Expressing My Wishes for Future Healthcare Treatment. This is available online or in print copy at most health units and doctor's offices. The guide consists of 56 pages of information and a workbook section and is available in multiple languages. Some people may find it easier to make a plan through Speak Up BC, an online interactive approach that goes step by step. If you choose to do ACP this way, you can save and come back to it later by sending an email link to yourself. Once completed to your satisfaction, you may share the document by email or print it. ACP can be done by recording a video answering the questions in the guide or having someone else write it for you and you sign. Remember, in most cases, ACP does not need to be notarized, but you should ensure that at least two other people have a copy. It's a good idea to let your doctor know that you have done advanced care planning and even share a copy with them. Organ and body donation programs. As people who do not believe in any spiritual existence after death, philosophically, organ donation is fully supported by humanists worldwide provided they have no other objections. After your one life, the fact that you were able to help another life is a marvelous scientific accomplishment. 
Because just 1% of all hospital deaths result in an organ donation in Canada, it's very important to register, and there's no better time than considering your advanced care planning if you haven't already registered as an organ donor with Transplant BC. Choosing to donate your body to research and study is another big decision that you can make to help further the advancement of our understanding of science and humanity. The University of British Columbia is the only university in BC that has this program. It is evident that they show great respect and care for the lives of their donors and even read portions of letters written by them before their passing explaining why body donation was important to them. Note that if there is an expected at-home death, organ donation may not be possible, as there is insufficient time for cooling and transport. Medical donation may also not be possible due to delay of transportation. Due to the high need of organ donation, takes precedence over body donation after death. Many people are not eligible for either due to the circumstances of death, so ensuring enough people are registered is key to saving the lives of thousands of organ transplant recipients every year. You can find more information about all these options under the Advanced Care Planning Resources section at the end of this guide. Advanced Care Planning Checklist Think. I've thought about what matters most to me and who can make healthcare decisions for me if I cannot. Talk. I've spoken to my family, friends, and healthcare providers about my healthcare wishes. Plan. I have recorded these wishes written, audio, or video, and given copies to people close to me and my healthcare providers. I've registered my decision to be an organ donor with Transplant BC and UBC Body Donation Program, if applicable. Review. Review your advanced care plan whenever there is a change in your health, personal life, marriage status, or living situation. You can change your advanced care plan at any time. 